Okay. So today's prophetic word is going to be nationwide is on your side. Akaye. Nationwide is on your side. Akaye. And today we are going to be talking about protection. Okay. So how God gave me this word last night. Hey, God just played an I say um that commercial about nationwide insurance. Hey, I just heard nationwide is on your side. And I was like, nationwide is on your side. Hey, and I was just thinking, like, Lord, what in the world? Because it it came out of nowhere. Okay. So I like I wasn't watching TV or anything, but I just heard nationwide is on your side. Hey. So what I did was I went to my phone. I already knew what Nationwide was, IKA. I knew it was an insurance company. And I know y'all say, I knew it was an insurance quote. Hey, but I just went to my phone and then I looked up about Nationwide is on your side. Hey, so briefly, to briefly um give a description of what I read, it was just basically insurance and um that provides protection as well as benefits, IKA. And I know y'all say, so IKA. Nationwide also, thank you, Lord, hallelujah, it's like the best, like it's supposed to be the best insurance that you can get, okay? It has great benefits. It's like, you know, nationwide, it's just all around. You are all around protected, okay? So it's a very, um, very good insurance. Okay, so basically it was God's confirmation that you are protected, okay? You are protected. Oh, no, 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 I say you are covered oh, no, no, I say, by the best okay. covered by the blood of Jesus okay. in the name of Jesus okay. Oh, no, 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 I say. okay so that was last night okay. when God said nationwide is on your side okay. and when I woke up today no, 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 I say, God placed a scripture before me hey Psalms 20 and oh, no, no, I say. so what happens is God will yeah, um, display a message to you, download a message to you, give a message to you, okay. Then also, God will come back around, okay, and give you verification. And then I say, He will verify what He's already placed in your spirit, in your heart, in your mind, something He's already spoken to you. Hey, and then He'll come behind it. And then I say, When it's God and give confirmation, okay, up to at least three times, okay. God confirms himself in threes, okay, at least to me, to let you know it's him. And so God led me to Psalm 20, okay, and I'm going to read it, and I have my Bible here, okay. So in Psalm 20, it says, may the Lord answer you in the day of trouble. May the name of the God of Jacob protect you. May he send you help from the sanctuary and give you support from Zion. May he remember all your offerings and regard and regard with favor your burnt sacrifices, Selah. May he grant you your heart's desires and fulfill all your plans. May we shout for joy over your salvation and in the name of our God, set up our banners. May the Lord fulfill all your petitions. Now I know that the Lord saves his anointed. He will answer him from his holy heaven with the saving might of his right hand. Some trust in chariots and some in horses, but we trust in the name of the Lord, our God. They collapse and fall, but we rise and stand upright. O oh Lord, save the king. May he answer us when we call. Hey! So furthermore, I say with this, okay, God is gonna give you say additional confirmation, okay, additional reassurance. Hey, whoo, because God is just that good. So when God was just now sending me on my way, okay. Go and say what I told you to say. No, 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 no. I say, go and do what I tell you to do. I say, God began to just download me with scriptures and verifications of his protection for his children. Hey. 
So God was just reminding me about um, us being in fear and having anxiety. Hey, so God is saying to us today, to me and to you, Akaya, to all of us, to his children. Hey, why are you in fear? Hey, why are you afraid? Why are you worried? So God was just confirming to me, hey, hey, do you not know who I am? Hey, God is saying, do you not know who I am, who he is? Hey, so God is saying, he created all things. He created all things. Hey, and God reminded me of the scripture that says, <clears throat> why do you fear man? Hey, that is mere breath. Hey, so God is saying, why are you fearing man? Why do you fear another man? Okay. Another human being that's just like you. And I know I say this person breathes like you, sleeps like you, eat like you. Okay. Hey, why are you afraid? Okay. When what this person does to you. And I know I say you can also do to this person. Hey, why are you afraid? Okay. Whatever you are afraid of this person doing to you, you can also do to this person. Hey. Scripture also tells us that we should not fear man, Akaye, but we are to fear God. Hey, man can kill your body, can kill your flesh. Hey, but we are to fear God. Hey, who can kill the body as well as your soul? Hey, so in other words, God is saying, I am the only one that you should fear. God is the only one that you should fear. Hey. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. In Hebrews, our Kaye, God gives us a promise that he will never leave you nor forsake you. Hey. God will never leave you nor forsake you. No, 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 I say that, I say which means you are not alone. Hey. So, no matter what you're facing. Hey. No matter what you're going through. No, no, no. I say it doesn't mean that you won't be afraid. It doesn't mean that you won't be scared. It doesn't mean that you will not fulfill. I mean, it, it does not mean that you will not feel these feelings. Hey. But you are to not embrace these feelings not agree with these feelings hey because it's not your portion hey god said that is not your portion fear is not your portion doubt is not your portion hey death is not your portion hey so if god is coming to tell you what is not your portion hey in god's word the promises God gives us life and give it abundantly. No, 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 y'all say. So what is your portion? Peace is your portion. Joy is your portion. Protection is your portion. Covering by the blood of Jesus is your portion. Prosperity is your portion. Hey, life, long life and abundance is your portion. Hey, Anything opposite of that, thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. God get the glory. Anything opposite of that, hey, is a lie. Hey, you do not come into agreement with that in the name of Jesus. Father, right now, in the name of Jesus, we rebuke every spirit of anxiety, worry, fear doubt depression suicidal ideation out of day i say we rebuke it in the name of jesus and we return it to sender back to the pits of hell where it belongs in the name of jesus for that is not our portion hey for father you come to give us long life lord in the name of jesus abundance peace love joy kindness meekness lord thank you and we receive all of that all of the good in the name of jesus we plead the blood of Jesus over our life, Lord. God, we put on our protection today, our armor of God. We speak your words that you've spoken over us. We come into agreement with that. Hey, 
We come against, Lord, the lies of the adversary in the name of Jesus. Lord, right now in the name of Jesus, if we have partnered with these things and allowed these things to come in and to torment us, hey, we ask you right now that you break it, Lord, in the name of Jesus. We renounce it. We denounce it. In the name of Jesus, Lord, Father, God, any agreement that we have came into known or unknown with the enemy, Lord, God, may it be broken by the blood of Jesus right now in the name of Jesus. Father, we give you all the glory, the praise, the honor, Lord, God, forever and never, Lord, you reign in Jesus' name we pray. Hallelujah and amen. Hey, may God keep you. Hey, may God order your steps. Hey. May God cover you in the blood of Jesus. Hey, everything pertaining to you. Hey, may you lose no good thing. Okay. May you keep doing the work of the Lord. Okay. May you walk steady. Hey, order my steps, Lord, in the name of Jesus. Hey, trust in what God is telling you. God is with you in the name of Jesus. God has you in the palm of his hands. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Scripture is... <clears throat> verifies and tells us, hey, Jesus says in the Bible, hey, that the Father has you in the palm of his hands. Nobody can snatch you. Hey, he says, nobody, no one can snatch you out of my Father's hands. You friend somebody because they got a gun. You friend somebody because they got a knife. You friend somebody because they done made threats against your life. But if my father, who art thou in heaven, created everything, that means he created the guns. That means he created the knives. He created everything. And if I'm doing what I'm supposed to be doing, walking in the way I'm supposed to be walking, if I'm obeying my father, if I'm doing my father's work, and if my father is in control of everything, then how can somebody come against me and kill me and my father not know about it? Why would my father allow that? Hey, my father is in control. So what I'm just going to do is not fear. I'm just going to trust and put my life in his hands because it's already there anyway. Not fear, no anxiety, no worry. God has me in his hands. I'll be all right. Whichever way it go. Be bold, be brave, speak God's word over you, pray, cover yourself, and go forward. Go forward. Keep doing what God told you to do. Have a blessed day.